It's the modern day Rainbow Road. Whoa, it's Craig. Wacky. Why bad? Oh Craig. my god! Rock. I got the oh cloak. my. What'd you oh, get? nice. Can I see it? The Cloak of Enigma. Oh. Hey guys, Hofstra here, and today I'm going to be reviewing the new cloak which drops from the Third Dimension Dungeon. It is called the Cloak of Cubic Enigma. So this cloak is actually pretty sick in that it allows for the rogue to do some extra damage while rushing, and sometimes a little extra damage to bosses. Let's jump right in. So the first ability that it does is called Shadow Burst, which leaves a burst of damage in your wake, and it lasts for 6 seconds and does 400 armor-piercing damage every 0.6 seconds within a 3.5 square range. There it is. Each of those does 400 armor pierce in that entire area. So stuff like rushing abysses and sewers and anywhere else that involves low health enemies. As you're rushing, they'll just die, giving you the fame from killing them, as well as potentially negating any damage that they would do to you the second you became uncloaked because they get absolutely nuked. Uh, especially since the invis on here is only 4.5 seconds, but the duration of the Shadow Wakes is 6 seconds. So you do have a little extra time after you uncloak where you can still do extra damage to get rid of any of those minions that were rushing after you. On equip, it gives 5 defense, costs 100 MP, and has a 6% XP bonus. The cooldown is 5.5 seconds, so believe it or not, you can actually start the cloak again before the explosions even run off, allowing for you to have a total of 11 explosions dealing 400 damage each time. So 4.4k extra damage is pretty sick, not gonna lie. Uh, it also works pretty well on stationary bosses that you can get close to, as the explosion is big enough. If you're standing at a safe distance, then you can still hit some of the explosion Whereas other bosses, you don't really want to stand too close to them in order to get the damage. So I would definitely recommend this cloak for rushing over anything. Uh, but it is pretty good for bosses that you drag back as the explosion is staggered behind you as you go. So that's going to be it for the new cloak from the third dimension dungeon. I think it's pretty fun to use. It's definitely a great substitute for damage if you don't have some of the rare cloaks like the Bloody Surprise or uh, the T7. But this one seems pretty common from the tea room in the new dungeon from what i've seen a couple of people have got it and i got it on like my third or fourth cube world and actually my first tea room so that's pretty cool that's going to be it i will throw on a little bit of gameplay so you guys can see this cloak for a little bit of an extended period of time thank you so much for watching enjoy the gameplay and i'll see you in the next one trying to impress me pulling out all the stops Making my head dizzy when you tell me what you want I just wanted you to see me Never thought you'd notice Thought that you should know I'm already sold so never let me go You had me at a la 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 About your game, I just wanted you to see me. Thought that you should know I'm already sold, so never let me go. You had me at a